Well, it's a rare skill for a fighter to be able to stand in the pocket and avoid taking significant damage. But if you've watched the film on this young fighter, that's exactly what he's able to do. He frustrates and exhausts his opponents, and he stays pretty relaxed because he's so defensively sound. He uses movement and defense to set up his offense consummate sticker and mover he gets his head off of the center line and even when you think you have him in a compromising position more often than not he's able to swivel that head and get out of harm's way seven struve comes from a dutch kickboxing background and has a towering reach advantage over most of his opponents he's also an extremely effective submission artist and ends a lot of his fights by locking in a choke All right, so here he is, the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and the man Dana White calls the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is making the walk tonight. This is perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. Great combination of speed and power, and the power is really set up by his precision, his dynamic striking style, his timing. Bruce Lee was quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. No one has been more adaptable than this man, Lee. This guy has incredible takedown defense. And of all the fighters in the UFC, he's amongst the most difficult to get to the mat. Our tail of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Two years apart, these two fighters with big differences in height and reach. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. Action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. is a Muay Thai kickboxer, holding a professional record of 32 wins, 11 losses. Standing seven feet tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Fighting out of Beaver with the Netherlands, Stefan Skyscraper! And now with his opponent, this man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Alright, grip the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out fighting. The fighters touch him up. Are right, you ready? You ready? Alright, so this UFC Grand Prix tournament is coming up next. This format has been all the rage with a lot of the hardcore mixed martial arts fans out there. Sort of an homage to the history of UFC and Pride with a single night tournament game event here and let's see who can be the last man standing here tonight. He hit him with an axe kick. Very nicely done. Tried to land the punch, but a swing and a miss by Lee. He's fainting with the punch. Connects with the punch there. Just misses with the right hook. That one hurt. Lee gets hit with that hook shot there. He's got to be careful to not allow the offense to follow up here. He missed that kick. Well, he got his head snapped back by that straight hand there, and he's shown a vulnerability tonight by leaning right into that punch.
coach, as he tries to set up his own offense, may want to focus on some defense here moving forward. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Nice jab. Oh, head kick attempt. It is blocked by Struve. And lands a good shot. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Beautiful. Lead kick is true there by Struve. Oh. Two minutes have expired off the first round clock. Oh, a nice straight there by Struve. Attempts a big hook to the head, but misses. And a nice jab. Struve gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Just misses with a left hook there. Oh, roundhouse kick. Struve gets tagged by that stiff jab. Defense not there for him thus far tonight. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Both men landing in that exchange. He's being creative in there. Leg kick now. Just over two minutes now to go. Once again, establishing the jab here. Oh, that left hand is on point. Throwing that jab, no good. He lands the head kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Struve's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Nice combination. Misses with the right hand. He is all about that left kick to the body. Oh, wow. Look at this. Catches the leg, then decides to let it go. Rips the body there for good measure. Great punch there. Sweet axe kick. Struve gets caught with that punch. He's got to figure out a way to get that guard higher, Joe. 45 seconds to go here in round one. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. Struve gets tagged with that jab. Pretty good weapon for him tonight. Again, going back to the well with the jab. Fifteen seconds remain in the round. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Going to the body there with the right kick. Oh, tagged him. That horn sounds like means, means we have reached the end of round one. Here's a big leg kick. Here's a nasty kick to the body. There's a powerful kick to the body. Good round. Good round. That was a good round, but I need those kicks to land a little more. Brittany Palmer is here, as always. Okay, you ready? Round two. Ready? Second round underway. All right, so here we go. Second round is underway. Pretty good first round, Joe. Crowd seem to like it. Not the greatest round you'll ever see, but good high-level action on both sides. Both fighters have their moments. We'll see, though, here in round two if there is less of a feeling out process and more of an uptick in the aggression here. Round two underway. 
Oh, he got tagged with the right hand there. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Stroop. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of there. Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left hook. We show you the total strikes. Struve gets tagged by that stiff jab. Oh, look at him snap off the jab. That's pretty to watch. Beautiful employment of the jab here. And a nice kick. Big left hand lands upstairs. That one hurt. Getting the hands going here early. Looking for the high kick. Well-placed kick there by Stroop. Well, he got cracked to the head there, Joe. He's gonna have to change things up here with his footwork, with his tempo. He continues to be vulnerable to that strike coming back. Gotta get his head off the center line. Look at that nasty jab. Oh, how about it? Huge kick landed. Another vicious kick to the liver. Those punches are very hard. This groove gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Oh, and there's a kick now to the body. That one blocked by Lee. Head off the center line, slips the punch. Drew gets caught by the inside leg kick. Nice accident. He's down. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. Action with the left. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Joe, back to the kick here. That's a miss. I need you to get that down now. Under two minutes here to go in round two. Lee gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Lands a kick. Oh, nice straight left. And both guys really throwing with authority. Well, he's got a strong jab. Miss with it there, though, Joe. Oh, another crisp jab lands flush. Nice way to keep the opponent at distance there. Looking to set up that head kick again. This one does not find the home. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Groove gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Less than a minute to go in the round. Well, the kick lands to the head there, Joe, but I gotta say, he moved right into it. So let's see if he can make the adjustments, try to circle out, and at the very least, get that guard up. Not a good look for him here. Oh, beautiful kick. Lee's right torso starting to bruise pretty good here. 30 seconds to go in round two. Nice shot. Goes to the body with the knee. He's try to establish that jab. Oh, good kick. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. And Wait, that's the end of round no, number two. No, 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 no. Let's take a look at it again here. And here's another clean shot that lands.
And another perfectly placed strike. Some really well-placed strikes on display in that round. Ariane Celeste doing work as usual. All right, next round underway, and you have to admire just how fresh these guys look, Joe. You know, both have made a concerted effort to improve their cardiovascular conditioning over the last several months, and it's paying dividends here on Fight Night. We see a lot of guys with hands on their knees in between rounds. If body language is any indication, both of these fighters have plenty left. Well, you gotta love this performance here tonight, Joe. He continues to land a high number of strikes, just as he did in the previous round, and seemingly not slowing down at all here tonight. Oh, and there is that patented head kick. One, two. Well, we've been talking about that jab and his perfect utilization of it all night long, and there it is again as he snaps his opponent's head back. You see the numbers bottom of your screen. It has been all about that short, crisp jab here tonight. Absolutely. Well, he ate a pretty big head kick there, Joe, and he's got to be careful moving forward, moving into striking range, leaving that head wide open. I know his corner looks frustrated. Let's see if this team can make the requisite adjustments. Struve gets lit up by that straight punch. And he's looking for that left. Big left hand there inside. Very nice. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Just out of range with that left hook. Oh, the roundhouse kick lands. Beautiful timing with the left hand. Big body, body shot. shot there, too. Whoa, head kick. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Oh, tagged him. Oh, Joe, that cut is getting worse. Rated R looking nasty now. Oh! So we have passed the midway point in the fight. Head kick there, blocked by Strew. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Just over two minutes to go. Got clip with the right hand. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Nice front kick. Oh, there's the swing and there's the miss by Lee. All right, so another strike to the body there, and Joe, we've seen in the later stages of this fight, not only an uptick in the aggression, but also in the body work. Didn't see a lot of that from him in the earlier rounds. Nice kick there by the skyscraper, Stefan Struve. Missed with that right hand. Oh, big right hook, but a whiff. And there's the axe kick. Oh, he missed with that right hand. Oh! And he connects there. Under one minute remains in round three. Man, Joe, he continues to leave that head open. His opponent's got to be salivating at this point in time. That jab has been there all night. You've got to get that head off the center line. And able to avoid the punch there. Nice slip by Lee. Unable to connect with a right hook. Oh, good hard kick. 
Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Just out of the range with that right hand. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. And here's a nice kick to the body that lands. And here's another kick to the body. And here's one more perfectly placed kick to the body. Excellent striking on display in that round. Ariane Celeste in the building as usual. All right, here's round four, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. All right, so the next round is underway here. We set off the top. This was very good matchmaking, evenly matched fighters, and that's exactly how it played out in the last round, which was very good. Not outstanding, but high-level MMA action on both sides. We'll see if one fighter can take control here. Man, I can watch this guy all day. He continues to land a high number of strikes, just as he did in the previous round. And at least to my amateur eyeballs, Joe, he's not showing any signs of slowing down tonight. And he eats a kick. Oh, beautiful jab there by Struve. Wow. Oh, landed that inside leg kick. Already a welt on his wow. opponent. Oh, he's rocked. Oh, he might be out. Nice leg kick. Big he body shot. Body. So, Joe, yet again, he moves right into that straight punch, and these are really starting to add up. He's going to have to figure some things out defensively, lean on the corner a little bit, but ultimately just move that upper body and move those feet, get that head off the center line. Doing a nice job working that inside leg kick. Continues to eat power shots here. Oh, how about the bruise on the outside of his thigh? He might need to start switching stances here, Joe, to protect that leg. And have fun walking tomorrow. Ow. And he landed the right hand there. left hand. Oh, continues to land those jabs at will. Nice way to keep the opponent at distance. Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Oh, nice. Ah, oh, he's unable to connect with the left hook, Joe. Right on the button. Just missed with the huge kick. That one hurt. Look at that, he's timing that jab. Oh, he landed it. Some nice back and forth action here. Beautifully timed and placed kick there by Stroop. Oh, clipped him with the jab. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Nice knee to the body. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Nice leg kick. Well, he left his body wide open there for that hook shot, Joe, and he paid for it. He is leaning in. I know he's got the guard high, but that means the body is exposed, and the opposition took full advantage there. Finds his range with the jab. 
Just missed with that right hand. Oh! oh huge right hand! He's in big trouble. Another shot lands upstairs. on the uppercut there. Oh, a nice inside leg kick landed there by the skyscraper, Stefan Struve. And he connects with the punch. Lands an outside leg kick of his own. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Lee. Lands a huge kick. Just misses there with the left. Oh! It appears the cut on his cheek is getting worse. Oh, good right hand. What a fight we got going on here! Horn sounds for the end of round four. All right, that's the end of the round, and this cut on the cheek, Joe, could be a factor moving forward. Certainly better to have the cut below the eye than above it, but the cut man's now got to get in there, shut that thing, and prevent it from being a major factor now moving forward. And another perfectly placed strike. Really excellent striking being displayed in that round. Ariane Celeste in the building as usual. It is the fifth and final round. Oh, he got tagged there. Oh! oh! He's got him right here. Big body, body shot. shot there, too. The skyscraper trying to finish. How about that chin? What an exchange here. Nice jab. That swelling on his eyes is really starting to get bad. Swing and a miss by the skyscraper, Stefan Struve. Well, he eats a punch to the head there, Joe, and he would be wise to get his head off of that center line. It's almost as if he's moving straight into that punch. He's got a nice snap to that leg kick. Very nice. Oh, he just misses with the left hook, Joe. Oh, head kick lands and with style points. Well done. Oh, good punch. Very nice timing with these shots here. Thought there might be an opening for the punch there, Joe. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Clean punch. Roundhouse kick lands. Nice jab. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. And there he swung with the haymaker. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Three minutes now to go to decide this one. He's looking to land the right, just out of range. There's the leg kick, that one checked by Lee. Struve gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now, gotta find a way to move those feet. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. So clock starting to become a factor here. Landed that one. That one hurt. Oh, they might call the doctor in soon here, Joe. He is bleeding like crazy. That cut, one of the worst you'll ever see. They might stop this fight. Eats a, a nice right hand. Excellent axe kick. 
Ali gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Under two minutes remain in the fight. That's a good knee to the body. Well, his opponent's got the read now, Joe, as he lands the punch to the head. He's got to change up his striking pattern and the tempo, or he's going to continue to be vulnerable to that count. is there. Effective punch there by Stroop. He comes forward with a flying knee that just missed hitting the target flush. One minute to go in the fight. He's trying to establish that jab once again. Oh. Excellent exchange there. Nice leg kick. Leg kick now. He's starting to pile those up. Look at the stats. Struve gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Liv. Struve gets tagged again, Joe. Another punch to the head, another land for the opponent. Just out of range with that strike. Very nice leg kick for him there. Can't take too many of those. How good is that jab by Lee? Struve's lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. Wow. Unbelievable. This crowd is on its feet. Those men just gave everything they had. All right, so this fight goes the distance. We should have a clear winner in this one. He was able to knock his opponent down once in the fight. Perhaps that was enough to warrant a 10-8 from the judges in that round, but clearly a dominant effort out of this fighter here tonight. And in all likelihood, he will be doubling up his money when he is announced as the winner here in a moment. Round five. There's the knockdown, and boom, on the button. The legs give out, and he's in some serious trouble. The official decision Ladies is in and resides with Bruce Buffer. Rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 50-45. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Stefan Stavis well, what a moment for this young fighter here tonight as he gets the nod by way of decision. I thought both fighters had their moments in the fight, but in the end, he was the better fighter tonight and deserved.